Hello, everybody. Welcome. Thanks so much for being here. And you know, we got a lot of great content. We're going to get right into it. No, uh, no uh, fluff, no hype. All we do is provide clear, factual content quickly because everybody is on a tight schedule and we all have families and, and I want to respect that. Guys, in less than two weeks, we've got Transform coming up. Our Rise to Enterprise event for Jasura International that is going to be um, uh, combined with Modair. And the reason that this is incredibly important for all of us is that this is our first ever Modair College and College and Sciences event, but more importantly, it's our last Jasuru International event ever, ever. Okay. So what I want you all to consider is: Were you at the first College and Sciences event with Modair in 2017? And were you there so that we could celebrate Jasuru International? And it bringing us to this position, and it being the last event for Jasur, out of respect to Jasur, I think it's a very noteworthy reason why we need to all be in attendance. And whether you're a current Modair social marketer or an existing Jasur IREP that's ready to convert, because we're so excited to be doing that, events will drive your business. The annual events, at minimum, at minimum, we should be participating in and being there and. And, and, and supporting our teams and our leadership, right? If you're young and new and don't have teams, you should be there so that you can see the hundreds, if not thousands of people that will be there this year that have similar like minds, that want the exact same things that we all do, right? And that way it builds your belief, your, it, it builds your enthusiasm and of course your knowledge base. And this is so important because I can tell you that Actually, I'm getting ahead of myself. I won't tell you that. I'll tell you that in a minute. Uh, let's get into this. I, I've conferred with uh, Justin Serra at Modair earlier today. All Modair products that will be purchased at Rise to Enterprise, because they're going to have all of them there, all the domestic products that are there, will be available for you to add to your volume at your zero for the month of February. So you want you and your teams there and buying as much of the products that we haven't had a chance to experience and taking them home so your teams can be experiencing this. And, and here's a very big part that I want you all to consider is your teammates that cannot get to Orlando for one way or other, whatever the reason is, you're going to want to get from them. Go online, go to modair.com, go to shop, all products, have them pick out the products that they want that you can buy for them under their IREP number, right, for the month of February, so it can cause them to have extra volume that swings down to that third leg, right? It's not going to happen March 1st when we get over to Modair and we transition in. So let's take advantage of that. So getting orders from your teammates prior to that can't go is going to help your volume, their volume, your rank, their rank, and everybody's check. Okay, but attendance is critical because we're talking about guys walking into momentum because of what's going to be happening here in two and a half weeks. When we get to March 1st and, and, and all of a sudden we're available in 30 international markets, you've got to be there to understand how to participate in this. You have to be there. It's, it, it's critically important to your business. Now, I know that we all got excuses. Excuses are like a certain part of the human anatomy, right? We all have one of them. We know what I'm talking about, okay? But if your refrigerator broke today, wouldn't you have to get it fixed? And I get it, because I would, but here's the, here's the fact of the matter, is that refrigerator is never going to make you a nickel. So why wouldn't you invest in your business? If you're here and you're on this webinar, you're clearly here because you understand the value and the potential of the financial element. Right? So, so what is it that's going to cause you to not make an excuse why you're not going, whether it's your plan A, right? Whatever it is, this is, this is historic in what is going to be happening in Orlando, and you have to participate. The um, um, a big element that I was looking at for you all today is look at these round trip tickets leaving on the 23rd, coming back on the 26th from Cleveland. Okay, and it, if you go to um, I think it was JetFly.com on Frontier and Spirit Airlines, $186 round trip. These were available at 142. You can see the the date and time in the lower right-hand corner, right? So there is no excuse that for less than dinner for four, you can be making a, an incredible 
personal investment into your business. And if you're coming from, where did I do this from? I think I did this from California. Or no, from New York, New Jersey area. Uh, pr prices are higher, right? But they are still reasonable considering the value of what we're going to be getting. And then I found a home that sleeps 10, that's 15 minutes away from the conference, for $722 for all three nights, all taxes, fees, everything inclusive. So if you had eight or nine partners and you wanted to share a house, it's $24 a night per person. Boom, right? So instead of saying, I can't, I can't, maybe what we should do is figure out how we can. And, and I did this, I researched the, the flights and this home on Airbnb, and I did it all in about 15 to 20 minutes. Right, so it comes down to how bad do you want it? Right? Maybe share rides to and from the airport. Save money. Use miles if you have them. Save money. Don't check bags. Pack light. Right? Don't don't wear the same thing for three days. I'll take you out back and give you the Marine Corps shower. Right? But, but carry on a bag. Don't check a bag. Save some money. How about sharing a room in Orlando? Maybe post on Facebook that you have a room, that you would split the cost, right? Not just share. You would split the cost of that room with somebody if there was somebody that needed it. It's Guys, we're family, right? And you might be helping somebody that desperately needs it. Check with your teams first and foremost, always, right? But offer it if you're, if you're, if you're willing to do that. But we got to change the mindset because an investment equates to the ability to return on your investment which makes money. So while we could save money, save money, save money along the way, doing it smart, getting there ultimately makes you money. Because here's the fact, in 2010, at our first rise to enterprise, there were 72 people in the room, 72 people. And four were on my team. And my business grew 2,240% up until the following rise to enterprise. Right, so if you wanna really get clever, and you say five of us, so each of us were responsible for a 400 plus percentage increase in my business. Okay, so what we have to do is we have to want it. You have to want it, guys, because we're not going global twice. You've got to figure this out. You've got to make the commitment to yourself and to those that said yes to you and yes to them, because I can promise you that everybody that goes to these meetings is not going to make 30,000 a month. But everybody that's making or wants to make that type of money is at every single meeting. You have to be there. I mean, imagine the excitement, inspiration, and knowledge that you're going to come out of there with Saturday night. And now imagine that you had two people on your team there, or three, or five, or ten. And all of you came out of there on the exact same page, excited, ready to hit the ground running, heading home with, with boxes of Modair product that you're going to get in Orlando that you don't have access to yet and have account for your February month end. And that's another thing I wanna talk about folks is month end coming up. I've, I've had calls from people saying, hey, should I hold off signing people up in Jasuro and just wait and sign them up in Modair? No, no, you should never do that. And here's why. By signing them up at Jasuro today, they're saving $40. If they buy only a case of product, then their net cost is 140 plus tax and freight about 160, right? And they're grandfathered in as a business person, as a social marketer over at Modair. If you wait, then they got to pay a $50 enrollment fee and at least $199 to get involved. So you cost them $100 by being selfish. I'm not saying that to slam anybody. I'm just saying that because that's the fact of the matter. We've got a moral obligation to those that say yes to us because the only one that benefits perhaps by you doing that is you. So you want to sign them up with the understanding that these fast start packages for 280, 500, and 1,000, when they add 160 in extra marketing materials on top of those packages as they sit and have sat, right, you're almost getting double the cost in product and marketing material, and that will never happen again after February 28th. That's the selling point on the fast start packages for the next two weeks and one day. Is guys, this is going away. You're never going to be able to get $1,800 or $1,961 in product and marketing material for a $1,000 investment ever, ever again. And the same holds true to bulk orders. 
So if you need bulk orders, or if you came in at 280 or 500, upgrade. Upgrade and get the benefit, because every upgrade's also gonna get $160 in extra marketing collateral. So it comes down to faith and simply believing in yourself and what it is that we're doing. And so why am I spending so much time on Orlando? Because it's obvious to me, global expansion is around the corner. It's no longer, excuse me, it's not even around the corner anymore. It's at our front door, as you've heard me say recently. So what we have to do is maximize our efforts. We have to strategize and work with our partners, work with our leadership and coming up with a solid plan, which is why I'll be swinging back around through all the markets in March is working with you all, because I'm already working on strategies of, of once we are global, what does that mean? And the information that you need so that you can maximize those efforts. So I'll be coming back around to all those markets. But we have to get to Orlando. We all have to learn and be on the same page so that when March 1st hits, there's not a learning curve. I don't want you guys having to figure out for two or three weeks in March what it is that you must do, right? Because if you don't know, you don't know. And if, and if I don't know that you're not there, then I don't know that you don't know. Wow, that was good. Whew, don't make me do that again. Okay. So here we were seven years ago, six and a half years ago, started off in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida. And now we're about to take on the world. It's here. It's not out the door, down the street, across the hill and over the woods and through the right to grandma's house. It's at our front door. It's right here. And I am so pumped and so excited because like when I was in Palm Beach, a, a small group of folks started freaking out because of France opening up, right? Lavinia and John, they were so excited and their teams and so many others with other international prospects. And here's a list of those countries. And this is real, it's real. Here's the international websites and thank you. <coughs> <laughs> Pardon me, Joan um, Huxler, for for uh, not only parting, part, uh, partnering with us in Florida and showing everybody the back office and being so helpful with the M3 product and general social uh, um, media marketing information and partnering with Amy and I. It was just absolutely wonderful to uh, have that level of, of partnership. And as a result of an email that she she received, she sent me this. And here's the websites for all the international markets. And I'm sure they're going to be going over every single bit of this at Rise to Enterprise. So we have an immediate course of action. Immediate. Now, what we have to do is get the Modere products that are available to us and fall in love with at least three of them so you have a product experience to share with friends, family, neighbors, colleagues, prospects, whatever. Have your teams participate in a planning session where you all sit together and write down who it is that you know internationally that fall within any of these countries. Or maybe it's people here that have family in those countries, right? But let's be strategic about this. Have everybody sit down and write down three to five names at minimum. And all of a sudden, if you have 10 people in the room, you have 30 to 50 names of people in international markets that we can now strategize towards. But it is strategic. We have to be strategic in what it is that we're doing. And we have to continue to do what it is that we've always done, which is look for that business partner. We know that social media, the great, great lesson that we got on Saturday from Joan was that social media plays such a, an incredible role in the retail customer pod in the pod, right? And that's wonderful. It's fantastic. Okay. But I know that it still takes a relationship and some of those people in the pod will certainly convert no question to become a social marketer, no question, right? But we have to still look for business partners. We've got to continue to do that. The flow for success training will build builders. It's consistent. It's also not overwhelming. It's a step-by-step -step process that allows for anybody to engage as much or as little as they want, as long as they follow the path. And the social media aspect will help you build customers. Of, again, of which some may convert to being business partners. Wonderful, right? So we've got both elements now. But the flow for success training has been converted for Modere. We now have it. It's ready. It's up and running. And it's, it's easily plug and playable. 
and I'm gonna I'm going to encourage you from a duplication perspective. If you want duplication, if you want to locate builders, if you want scripts and overcoming objections and understanding how to have conversation with people, because we know that people don't join products, right? They join people, right? So we have to be at our best. We have to be so compelling for them to want to join us. And then when they do, when we, when we show them the flow for success training, they're going to be impressed that we have the roadmap and that causes comfort, right? So people join people. Let the social media element that the Modair has, which is incredible, right? They had all, the, all the, the, the pages that they have that we can tag people on. It's Ed, tag, and message. Thank you, Joan. Ed, a friend, to a note, on a page, or to a page. Then tag them, and then message them. Private message them. Okay, so we'll get into that. Joan's going to be partners with us, and she's going to help us with all the social media side of things. Now, the thing I want you all to understand is that <clears throat> our demographic at Jasu International is just a wee bit older than Modair. And I don't want you to get frightened by there being a, an emphasis on social media. That's why what I'm focusing on with you is staying true to the flow for success training so that you don't feel that. Because frankly, I'm not that versed at social media either. I mean, I got a Facebook page, sure, I got LinkedIn. Yeah, I got them, but I, I really don't know how to maximize them. So I don't want you to feel as though, oh, no, I got to do all that. No, what you got to do is prospect. Understand how to overcome objections. Have a script available for those that, based upon demographics, you can share with and invite them to a meeting, invite them to a three-way call. None of that changes. So the flow for success will continue to build builders, right? Because we constantly have to have an eye out for builders. And the social media component over time, we're going to learn it. We're going to learn it together. It's going to help us build customers that may actually help us enhance the builders on our team. But when we join our company, guys, and, and we get started, it's like the proverbial net, right? We're told to go out and catch people. And it's my job, my job specifically, to help you take this ridiculous little net and get rid of that little frame and attach that net to our team's net. Because this is teamwork. Right? Teamwork makes the dreams work. And my goal for you is to be as good a leader as I can possibly be to bring you the most co consistent, accurate information that we all need to benefit from, to participate in, to learn from, right? So that we can share with our teams that don't go to Orlando. We have to be that committed. And my job is to ensure that we are doing exactly what we must. So that we can experience this incredible global expansion together and have fun doing it while, while changing lives in a 24-hour, seven-day-a-week income model. Guys, I don't think any of us truly understand because I've never experienced it. I've seen it and I've heard about it. I've seen it with other people where going international and waking up and seeing <clears throat> 5, 10, 20, 200 people on your team in Europe overnight because they had a great meeting or great meetings. So my job is to show you how best to prepare for that by us being as good as we could possibly be before we get there. And, and I hope you understand the value of that. Okay, so before we go, we're not going yet. I'm going to share with you a one-minute video. You guys have seen it for seven years now. It's, it's more relevant today than it ever has been, so stand by.